How's it going, nerds? Merc with the mouth, Deadpool here. And I am here at the one and only Dallas Holiday Special Comic Book Show. And here at the uh, museum mall. And uh, well, Ari cosplays Deadpool. And uh, well, about to head up the elevator. Looks like this place is gonna be a tad bit more different than, well, last year and from the last time I was here. But let's see how this convention and event goes because, well, why not? Work with the mouth, Deadpool, and, uh, well, why heck not? There's, well, a few, uh, yeah, well, uh, A and B list names here. Okay, so, so far so good, and uh, well, as I got a little bit of some goodies, I'm gonna go throw it in my car, but uh, also, I got to meet uh, James O'Barr, I got a picture with him, I got him to sign my comic novel on The Crow. If that name does not ring a bell, James O'Barr is the guy responsible for creating uh, The Crow. Uh, that comic is just overall dark, brutal, and it's also like, a very gruesome comic. I mean, if you, I mean, uh, not too long ago, I did watch the uh, Brandon Lee Crow movie from the 90s, and I did read the comic finally not too long ago, and I even picked it up. And uh, well, I got him to sign it. I'm, I'm assuming y'all saw the picture already. I got, I had a really nice chat with him. I even asked him like if the Crow would do a crossover with like any character in comics, and he replied Batman, and I'm like. That is my answer. I want that. I mean, I would love to see that because Batman is like, obviously my end all, be all, my favorite superhero, my favorite fictional character and all. So yeah, I, I'm i surprised he said Batman. So wrapping up today, and uh, well, don't worry, I will be back tomorrow. But so far, it was really good. I mean, got to run into a few of my cosplay friends, and cosplay contests happened, and I won second place because I acted like Deadpool. And uh, well, I also well, <laughs> I also had my speaker system on, and I played the song "Glamorous" just like in the. Uh, just to be a callback to, well, Deadpool Wolverine, of course. But yeah, today was good, today was excellent. I had a blast being the Merc with a Mouth. Well, from the time he joined the X-Men. But yeah, really good. And looking forward to tomorrow. So let's see what tomorrow is like. Day two. Back for day two, y'all. So today I am the human spider from, of course, Tobey Maguire's first Spider-Man movie. I'll admit this cosplay, I've not worn it in like a little over a year and surprise it still fits and surprise I still look good. And uh, yeah, just looking forward to, well, it's probably gonna be a slow day here at this comic book show, but uh, I don't know, I just, well, what, figured why not? Uh, I am uh, meeting one celebrity and I am gonna get some more comic book goodies. And, uh, who knows, maybe I might see some other friends of mine and just vlog around a bit here and there. 
And uh, yeah, and I do feel very comfy in this cosplay of mine. So I met a B-list celebrity. This is Michael Papajohn, AKA the carjacker, AKA the man who killed Uncle Ben in, well, the, in Tobey Maguire's first Spider-Man movie. I mean, he was here and I was like, oh my God, I gotta suit up as human spider and meet the guy. And he was nice enough to give me an autograph and an extra signature of like a bit of a, like, uh, I, I, I don't know 100% what it is. I think it's like a biography or something on like his character. But yeah, I mean, he's also in uh, movies like Water Boy, Little League. Uh, he has small roles in several movies. He's always main character number 10 or main character number 20. But hey, I mean, it was really awesome meeting him. We got like several photos and yeah, he was impressed by my cosplay. He was incredibly nice. I even asked him like, what was it like working with Tobey Maguire? And he said that he was really cool. He was really nice. They both had the same uh, stunt teacher, I think. <laughs> I, I forgot what he said on that part, but yeah, he said that he worked with Tobey Maguire and he said that he was really nice and he is his favorite Spider-Man, but understanding opinion, that's cool. I mean, hey. I, yeah, I will admit the Tobey Maguire Spider-Man movies will always be my childhood movies and even though Tom Holland's my favorite, Toby I will still have a soft spot for. Yeah. I will admit, I do have the money for this poster, and I want this poster for obvious reasons, but I still have the space. I mean, if I get more space, I will get that poster. One of these days, this will be mine! So, sad news it is now coming to an end, it's wrapping up, but I had an enjoyable time, it was good. I mean, today was quick, I will admit, it was, it was very quick, but it was worth it, it was good, and, well, it was good. Uh, I will admit, I ran into a dozen cosplay friends of mine, even though a couple of them were just casual today, and, uh, well, I did also get a chance to get some comic book goodies, and it was mostly Michael Papa John that made today fun and enjoyable because of our chat, and even though it was, like, five minutes, well, it made the, the convention and event a lot more easier, better, but, yeah, so... 
I'm actually just gonna go grab bites to eat and uh, well I gotta get going to work soon but yeah I had a fun enjoyable time as the human spider again I have not worn this suit in a very long time but I brought it out and glad it still fits now I'm also gonna do some TikToks in the suit before I have to take it off but again had fun had enjoyable time can't wait till like next big event happens and so which may be a while but again had a good time so thank you guys so much for watching this vlog of mine don't forget to like this video subscribe hit the comments hit the bell so you're notified for my next video don't forget to also follow me on all my social media stuff follow me on instagram twitter and uh, well tiktok make sure to follow me i just might follow you guys right back but until next time y'all it's your friendly neighborhood the human spider and uh see you chumps i know that's a spider-man 3 reference but hey tell mcguire spider-man